Hi guys, today we're going to be reviewing a very special airbrush indeed. It's the Awata Custom Micron CMC. First of all, I'd like to say a huge thank you to airbrushes.com who sent me the airbrush out for review. If you check the description box below, you'll find a direct link to their web store and you can check out more about this wonderful airbrush and other airbrushes they sell on their web store. As you can see, the packaging for the Custom Micron is exceptional it comes in a very heavy metal uh, case which weighs about one and a half kilos as you can see here each individual custom micron is tested by an expert and you also get a Nawata hobby sticker and here's the test piece of paper that you can see how fine details we can get out of this very very special airbrush indeed I'm just zooming in a little here just to show you how fine those lines are. You also get a, a very brief manual going over all of the aspects of looking after your uh, custom Micron airbrush. There's a new initiative that Awata have just started up called Five Ways to Spray. What that is, is a fantastic easy to end understand guide on what type of airbrush would be best suited for the individual so it literally labels the type of application that each airbrush in the Awata range would be used for as you can see here from this diagram the custom Micron airbrush is absolutely fantastic for extreme detail fine detail and even can handle medium detail as we take a look at the airbrush we can see that it has a open cup lid which is fantastic for easy access to the paint but it's also going to help stop spillages at the same time the really wide trigger has fantastic thumb grip or finger grip depending on how you hold your airbrush but I want to emphasize how buttery smooth a custom micron airbrush is they're just so beautiful to use guys and until you've actually held a, a Nawata Custom Micron in your hands and you felt the uh, precision engineered quality of the airbrush it's hard to um, put into words how lovely they are the Awata Custom Micron comes with a moisture trap now you may already have a moisture trap on your compressor but this is like a second line of defense that you can add to your airline um, which is a really good feature to have in this box set you also get some lubricant which is fantastic for keeping that buttery smooth mechanism um, working really smooth for uh, many years to come uh, you also get a, an Awata little spanner to take off the fluid nozzle. And here you can see some of the very fine lines that I'm able to get out of this airbrush. Now there is other Awata airbrushes that will give you fine lines, but the Custom Microns make it so effortless and they're just so in tune to produce such extremely fine detail with ease I've placed the miniature here for scale so you can actually see how thin some of these lines are the miniature is 28 millimeter scale so that's just a, a, an idea of how thin some of these lines are also the Awata Custom Micron airbrushes uh, optimized to work at low PSI which is fantastic for miniature scale uh, painting which I personally do as we need to work at low PSI here I'm showing you a Space Marine shoulder pad and I'm going to show you how I can pre-shade a shoulder pad which is smaller than my little fingernail and I can highlight it with absolute ease with this airbrush There's some technical terms that we use in the miniature scale hobby and called object source lighting or OSL for short and the custom micron airbrushes are absolutely superb at this. You could literally add OSL to a Space Marine's eyes with ease with this airbrush.
Whilst I'm actually painting the shoulder pauldron, I just want to know that in my personal opinion, and I've been airbrushing now for about eight years, that the Awata Custom Micron airbrushes are unrivaled against any other airbrush that there is. They are just that good. As you can see here, I'm getting those super fine lines again. I'm coming in with a lighter colour in the middle of the shoulder pauldron and we're just going to highlight it. And as you can see, we've got a perfectly uh, shaded and highlighted shoulder pad in about a minute. And as you can see, the shoulder pauldron looks fantastic, even being still wet. So let's wrap up this review and go over some of the key features of this Awata Custom Micron. Now, it's perfect for extreme detail, for fine detail and medium detail. It has a crown docking system at the back and the crown on the front of the airbrush has little, like little slits like a crown which enables air to flow out the airbrush as you're moving really close so you don't have to take the, the needle cap off in this instance a crown cap at all uh, so you don't risk the uh, damage of your airbrush needle. In all reviews, you have to balance the positives with the negatives. And there really is only one negative with a custom Micron from Awata, and that's the price. But with the price comes quality. This airbrush is built to last precision engineered quality that's going to last you many, many years. So to wrap up everything we've said so far in the review and to just put it into a short possible statement as I possibly can the Awata Custom Micron is literally the best airbrush you can get for extreme detail for miniature painting and other op um, applications lastly guys I want to say a huge thank you to the airbrush company at airbrushes.com for sending me out the custom micron for review i'd really appreciate it if you put a comment down below if you own an awata airbrush and let others know how amazing and how great the quality of awata airbrushes is uh, i also want to say a huge thank you of course for you uh, guys to taking the time out of your day to watch this video thank you very much and i'll catch you in the next one